Today we're going to demonstrate how to use this Blade Runner from Rockwell. We had a customer that had some difficulty with the, uh, I think it was with the blades, and so we're just going to make this, this uh, demonstration to help out a little bit. So this particular saw uses these basic jigsaw uh, T-shank blades, and they've got little grooves in here, and they're a little bit tricky inserting into the mechanism here, but we're going to push down on the blade release here and then slide this. It's kind of a two-button safety mechanism and we're going to slide the blade into there and the key is you got to seat it all the way into the base if you don't put it all the way in and you let go you can see the blade still loose it's not in there it's not not held tightly but if we push it all the way in and make sure that t-shank grabs a hold of it and then we let go then you can see it's firmly into the blade mechanism and it's resting perpendicular to the, the the flywheel here it's off to the side so once we get the blade in there firmly, we're going to take the cover and put it back over the blade for protection. And then the, uh, the guard up here can come down and you can adjust it with the, the screw on the neck back here. So we're just going to take a piece of pine here and just cut through it as a demonstration. This blade is a little bit dull so it's not going to cut real fast, but we're just going to line up the, the arm and tighten it down. And then we're going to go ahead and turn the power on and cut through the wood. So we've got a nice perpendicular 90 degree angle cut here on the blade. It, it uh, like I said, it's a little bit dull, but uh, it seems to cut real nice and uh, real versatile for different woodworking projects. So there you have a little demonstration on the Rockwell Blade Runner. 